All right, guys, this is part two. I went upstairs to grab my coffee. I'll make a quick 30 minute video here, then I'm gonna go work on the lawn for a good hour and a half and make a good like 11 bucks. Um, I can ask her to give me $15. I can cash in my cans, I'll have enough to get a beer. A beer with my, I have one beer with my, uh, with my smokes, so obviously. And tomorrow I work. I'll make sure I save a good like six smokes for tomorrow for work. That way I have something to smoke for work. Obviously I work at nine tomorrow. And if you ask me to work Friday, I'm like, hey, can you give me Friday? I don't want to, can you give me Friday off? I need you on Friday. I'm like, can you just have another just watch the work? I don't want to work six days a week, man. I mean, you're making money. Yeah, I know I'll make like 700 plus bucks, but I don't want to work six days a week. I want, I want like two days off at least. Five days is fine. But I'm not going to work six days a week for you, man. I want to work five days. I can get two days off. It's, uh, it's tough on my body, man. But the good thing about this job is that it's slack because you only, like, work at 8 in the morning and you're out of there by, like, 2.30, 3.30, 3.50. You're out of there. You get the rest of the day off for yourself. You can go to the bar after. You can still get your beer and smoke. You can still chill after. It's slack work working at Coco Fruit. Is that right? Yeah. Slack work working at Coco Fruity. Obviously. So will this be the year, guys, that Ivan O'Meara gets his first girlfriend? I don't know, man. We'll see what happens, I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, man. It's crazy, huh? I get my first girlfriend ever, I'm saying. Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. I'll date her for like three years. That's good enough. Three years I'll date her for. So let's say if I date her this year, two and a half years around there. Let's say, I, I don't know, by sometime fall this year, I start dating her. You know, then I'll date her for like, yeah, two and a half years over this. 2024, 2025. And once I know I, I got to pay the fee, that I'm now going to be done with dating. I got to, I got to end it, obviously. Yeah. Ivan, will you be playing on top of the world when you're with her? Yes, man, we'll be playing on top of the world when I'm with her because everyone will be staring. Everyone's constantly staring at, at what? Everyone's constantly staring at you and her, obviously. Because I'm a son of God. Everyone's staring at me and her when, I'm, when we're out. And people might take out their phones and take pictures and videos, and that might trend. If I tremor with her, then she'll be, well, I'll be feeling on top of the world. Like, holy shit, this is crazy. <laughs> Wherever I go, people take reels and pictures. This is crazy. It trends. And she feels on top of the world. You guys will know what she looks like. Holy shit. The chick that Ivan's dating is hot. Yeah. The chick that Ivan went on a date with, she's hot, man. She's a redhead. Rob Mary Burnett will like her. Holy shit, she's hot. And he likes redheads, Rob Mary Burnett. Yeah. He likes redheads. <laughs> and she's a redhead. She's a redhead, man. Yeah. She has red hair. Reddish, darkish brown hair. Yeah. Yeah. So that's my plan. Sometime mid June, you ask her. I'm not. I you ask her uh, for, for on a date this week. No, I'm not going to do that. I'm not ready yet. Talk to her a bit more. Get to know her a little bit better. Then you ask her on a date. Like a month from now, I ask her on a date. Like mid June, I do it. She goes in the room and I have my cell phone ready and I and I go in, you know, and say, like, okay, this is my opportunity to ask her on a date. I go in, no one can hear us. We're in the room. Go in there and 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 and, 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 and what? She's in the room. I'm like, hey, you done your shift? Yeah, I'm done my yeah, I'm done my shift. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like hey, I was just wondering, do you want to go out to dinner sometime? And she's like, uh, what? I'm like, do you want to go out to dinner sometime? You know what I'm saying? She's like, uh, sure, I'll, I'll go out to dinner with you, Ivan. Okay, what's your number? <laughs> like, holy shit, she said yes. Oh my god, she said yes. She didn't reject me, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? She said yes. Like, holy shit, she said yes. I'm saying, I'm, like, I'm all nervous, you know what I'm saying? 
Because when I ask her that, I'm like, all, all that's going through my mind is, please don't get rejected. Please don't get rejected. She says yes. Okay, so what's your number? I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, what's your number? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, my number is this. And I have my contact information ready. I, I add her name. I know her name, obviously. You add her number. And once she gives you her number, repeat it to make sure you got the right number. Okay, so your number is this, 819, this, 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 this. Yes, I haven't asked my number. Repeat it just to make sure you got the right number. That way, that way you didn't make a mistake. Because you don't want to make an error with her, uh, with, 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 with her number. Sarah. You don't want to make an error, obviously. Or you could have a pen. You could have a pen if you want. Have, write down her number on your phone and write it down on a piece of paper too if you want. You can do that if you want, obviously. And you, if, if, as long as you have her number, you won't need to give her your number because if you shoot her a text, your number will pop up always. Okay, I'm gonna shoot you a text to make sure you got my number to, to make sure you, I, I I got the right number. I I just texted you. Did you get did you get the I just texted you. Did you get the message? Yeah, I haven't. I got the message. Yeah, I said hi. Yeah, I, you said hi. Yeah, okay. That's my number right there on 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 on, on file. And then she saves your number on her phone. And she writes on my name, Ivan. So Sarah. Yeah. Obviously. She writes on my name, Ivan. And when she leaves that room, she's all happy. Oh, okay, I'll, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You, could, you don't have to ask her, when are you available? You can just text her that if you want. But it's better to ask her face to face. Hey, by the way, are you available like next week? Ivan, I'm available this week. I'm like, yeah, I want to do the date now. I want to do the date next week. Just because next week I get paid. I understand, Ivan, yeah. I want to do the date when I just get my when I get when I get my check when I just get paid. Oh, Ivan, because you're running out of money. Yeah, I'm kind of running out of money. I want to do the date when I just get paid next week. Okay, Ivan, that's fine. Uh, I'll text you. I text her a few times. I'm because before you go on a date with her, I'm probably gonna shoot maybe maybe out maybe eight texts and that's it. She might maybe shoot maybe six, seven, eight, nine texts and that's it. Don't text her too too much. Text her a little bit obviously, but don't text her too too, too much. So Sarah, and once the date happens, that's when she'll text you even more. And she now likes you more, obviously, after your first date. I don't, I don't say, and she, she leaves the room, she's all happy, she has that smile on her face. Everyone's like, why is she smiling, you know what I'm saying? And I, I, it's it's going gonna, gonna to be a bit weird because she she leaves the, the, the locker room, and I leave the locker room with her. And I'm like, what, what just happened in there? The employees are curious, honestly. Did I even ask her on a date? And I had that small on face. I'm like, yeah, I, I, I got her. I got her. I got her a number, man. I, I'm going to go on a date with her. Everyone's curious. I'm like, yeah, I'm not telling you shit. Tell me your business. And that's where the best place to ask her on a date is in the, in the room, in the change room. Where the lockers are and everything, ask her on a, on, 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 on a date there. Because nobody can hear you in there, Susanna. Whereas if you do it. If you, do, if you ask her on a date, like, in, in the counter area, people are going to eavesdrop. They're going to hear her. Obviously. Unless it's towards the end of the ship. If it's towards the end of the ship, it's not bad because there's only like maybe uh like two people in the kitchen and and, and there's only maybe three waitresses left, but they're still gonna eavesdrop. That's my point. They can they can they can they, they can spread the news. Whereas you ask for in a locker room, it's just you and her in there. Like you know what? I introduced myself to her in that in the change room. I'm gonna ask her on a date once she's in the change room. Don't be freaky when you do it. She goes in, okay, this is my opportunity. You take your phone, you go in there. I'm like, hey, you done your shift? She's like, yeah, I'm done my shift. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like hey, and then I, you ask her on a date. Obviously. That's what Sarah. And if she likes you, she'll say yes. If she doesn't like you, she'll say no. <laughs> if she says no, I'm going to be like, holy shit, I got rejected. I'm going to feel like total shit. I'm like, oh my God, I, I lost self-esteem with a woman, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to feel like total shit. I'm like, I don't understand. What did I do wrong? Maybe she has a boyfriend. I don't know. I don't think she has a boyfriend, though. I don't think she has a boyfriend. I think she's single. Yeah. Obviously. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
and make sure you dress nice for your. All I'm gonna be thinking about is my first date. I remember, I remember like 13 years ago, my uh, my stepbrother went on a date with some girl. He was working security. He went on a date with some girl. He was telling me, yeah, he was telling me how like he uh, he she asked him on it. The, the chick asked him on a date, and he went on a date with her. They had a little fling together, obviously. I remember he was talking about how he was excited for that date. This is like back in 2010. Um, 2010, man. A long time ago. And he went on a date with a chick. He went on a date with a chick, obviously. And what? And, uh, yeah, they had a fling, obviously. I remember he was excited. Yeah, I'm going on a date with, with, with a chick, obviously. She asked me on a date uh, on a uh, work. I'm like, holy shit, you did. Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. So, Sarah? And, yeah. I'm, but uh, the difference between me is I'm not going to tell anyone I'm going on a date with her. I'm not telling my youngest, I'm not telling my stepbrothers, I'm not telling my stepparents because they're going to get a bit jealous. And I don't trust my stepparents, I don't trust my stepbrothers, I don't trust my, my, my family, so that, my stepfamily. I don't trust them at all. I don't trust Vijay's family either. Well, Vijay's family will, well, what, they, they don't live in Elmer, obviously, but I'm not telling my family shit. I'm keeping the date to myself, obviously. But yeah, I think, yes, I'm keeping the date to myself. I'm keeping the date to myself, obviously. I don't know. I go on and she's all happy. You know, so I'm like, oh, please don't tell anyone I work in China. I was the next day I work, everyone knows. <laughs> How the fuck did you know? Yeah, she told us, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like she tells everyone, yeah, I'm going on a date with Ivan next week. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh, why did you tell them? Oh, my God. I have less know where you're going on a date. No, I'm going to keep it to myself. Or I could tell you I, I asked her on a date. Nah, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to keep it to myself, man. I'm going to keep it to myself. Obviously. That way the employees don't know. Because if I make the video, the employees will know I asked her on a date. Because they all watch my videos, obviously, right? Yeah. So I'm going to I'm gonna make it... Make it... Uh, keep it private, obviously. And dress nice for your date. That way she, she appreciates. If you dress nice for the girl, she'll know, oh my God, I can dress very nice for me. Yeah, she'll, she'll, she'll appreciate that. And if she dresses nice for you, that means she really likes you, obviously. She wears like her nice, like casual clothes on her nice jeans. She wears like nice jean pants, nice shirt. She, her hair is nicely done. She either has a ponytail or she has uh, her, her, her long hair. I mean, like girls bare with ponytails or long hair. Oh, long hair. They look much better, obviously. She has a, she, she did her hair. Her hair, she has her nice long hair. She smells nice. She put her nice makeup on. I mean, she likes you. Yeah. And you dress nice, too. I don't know. I get myself a nice, maybe, dress shirt. And I get myself nice jean pants. And, and, and my, my, myself nice jean pants. And I wear my nice shoes. I took my shower, I bought my body wash, I scrubbed my body, I brushed my teeth. It doesn't hurt to uh to have a few gums before you before you meet her. Where your breath smells good. Get some nice deodorant, put the order in you put nice deodorant, you smell good. You look nice. Oh my god, I've been dressed nice for me, yeah. So appreciate that obviously. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, okay, seven thirty next Friday. How does that sound? 7.30 next Friday at 7.30 next Friday. 7.30 next Friday at St. Hubert's. Obviously. Then during, you know, and once you ask her on a date, now you can you can talk to her more during during the week, obviously. When you work during, during the week, obviously. But I don't think she works weekends. I think she only works weekends. She's part-time, I think, at Coco Fruity. 
By the way, she's the hottest wait waiter there. Yeah, she's the hottest waitress there. <laughs> she's by far the hottest waitress there. Obviously, she's like an eight out of ten, man. She's she's attractive. She's an attractive chick. Obviously, you guys saw her. You know what I mean? She's attractive. You're like, holy shit, the chick I've been saying is hot. Yeah, she's hot, man. VJ would be like, VJ is curious. If I try to read curious, I wonder how hot she is. Let's see how hot she is. You know what I'm saying? Who's Ivan Day? You know what I'm saying? VJ's looking at you. like, what are you doing with him? What are you doing with my husband? She's crazy, obviously. I'm like, VJ, you can't say shit. I shut you for good, man. I'm done. Yeah. There. Yeah. yeah. All I'm thinking about, that's why I'm going to ask my boss, hey, can you give me Friday off next Friday? Off? I don't want to work Friday, man. I don't, I don't want to be tired. <coughs> I don't want to be tired on, my, on the day I go on the date. No, I like, yeah, give me, give me, you can give me Fridays and Wednesdays off. <laughs> And, he, and I work Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, Sunday. That's five shifts a week, yeah. Yeah, that way on Friday I can prepare myself. I can go to bed, set your alarm, just in case you don't oversleep. Make sure you set your alarm to like, to like uh, three o'clock. When I wake up, I make a video. Obviously, I can work on the on, on the lawn, obviously. No, by then, the lawn will be done. I'll be done the lawn by then. I can make a video at 3 o'clock, and then uh, I make the video. Obviously, then I go to the store. I get my beer and smokes. Why, why do I want beer and smokes? To celebrate. After the date, I come back. I have a drink for myself. I have a drink for myself. Yeah. And I'll be at the St. Hubert's like 15 minutes early just in case. You don't want to show up there. Don't show up late, man. It looks bad on you. Don't even show up five minutes late. It shows that you don't care about her. Make sure you show up there early. And chances are if she likes you, she'll be there early too. I don't know. I leave at like 7.10. I walk to St. Hubert's. She's already there waiting for me. I'm like, holy shit, she's there. You know what I'm saying? And, and what? And then I have a smoke. I'm all nervous, man. I hope this date goes well, man. I'm fucking nervous. I see her. When you see her, you give her a nice hug, obviously. I will the employees know. Oh, I'm just saying this. The only way the employees will know is if I ask her on a date in 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 in, in the kitchen, and the the, the the some people eavesdrop and they tell everyone, or she tells everyone that I went on a date with her, or, or I trim with her. Those are the only ways the you guys the the, the the employees will know you went on a date with her, and if I make a video about it. So four four things. I make a video on my YouTube channel about it, you then they will know obviously. But I'm which I'm not gonna do. I'm, I'm gonna keep it to myself. <laughs> it's none of your business, guys. I don't try. I'm sorry. You're not gonna know what she looks like. It's none of your business. Did you make everything you do my life your business? It's none of your business, obviously. You know what I'm yeah, I travel there. You know what I'm saying. I tried with her. Yeah. Perhaps. And if not, everyone is staring. Uh, everyone is uh, staring. They're all curious how she looks like. I wonder what this chick looks like. And they're all curious. They're all curious, obviously. And I, we go into St. Hubert's. I'm like, I'm like, table for two, please. You know what I'm saying? And she's like, yeah, table for two. Right? And I go with her and I have a nice dinner with her. At, uh, at St. Hubert's. I don't know if they have beer or St. Hubert's. I don't think they sell beer. If they have beer, I'll buy buy your beer too. Hence why, go on a date the week you get paid. That way you have a lot of money in your bank. That one day you can spend like $80 on your meal and you can buy like a picture for you and hers. I'm sorry. If you want. Make sure you have money, obviously. And then your bar date, you can do it on maybe on, on, on a Sunday or something like that. Two days later. Hey, do you want to hang out, like, on Sunday? Yeah, sure, Ivan, I'll hang out. Yeah, you want to go to the Armour Bar on Sunday? You know what I'm saying? On, on the Sunday. Obviously. But you go early. Go around maybe 8. You can leave around 11. Yeah, I got work in the morning. I can I, I gotta, we, I can't stay up too late. I can be at the bar with you maybe till midnight. And I, we got 11.30 and we got to leave. 
We can get Bob's Pizza after, and I can call a cab for you. Give me twenty bucks for your cab home, Sarah. Yeah, but I'm not gonna focus on the on the Elmer Bar. I'm gonna right now. I gotta focus on talking to her more, and then what? And then getting her her number, and uh, focus on that first date, which is my Saint Hubert's date. I want to go to Saint Hubert's with her, obviously. You could go to like McDonald's or Bob's for your first date. That's very unprofessional. Go to a restaurant. Go to a restaurant on your first date. Go to a restaurant, some Sarah. And St. Hubert's is the only restaurant nearby I can think of. The next restaurant I can think of is, is Denti's. Coco Fruity, you can go there, but like she works there. You don't want to, don't go out on a date with her where, where, they, where, they, where you work. Don't do that. Otherwise, all the employees are going to know. Go to what? Yeah, St. Hubert's is the only place I can think of that's close by. And they have good food. They have nice chicken. They have nice fries. I'm saying they have good food there. I'm going to go to St. Hubert's. I have like a chicken burger with like some fries or something like that. You know what I'm saying? You have a good, I have a good time with there at St. Hubert's, obviously. If they have beer, buy her a beer. Hey, do you want a pitcher? Sure. And you buy, you buy a pitcher. That way you have a good time with her. And if I trend with her... Then she'll be fleeing on top of the world. Oh my god, I mean, this is the best date of my life. I feel so on top of the world. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Then once the date's over, if she drives, just give her a hug. I'll, I'll, I'll see you. I'll, 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 I'll see you later. Yeah, I'll see you later. You know what I'm saying? She gives you a she, you hug or give her a nice hug. If she gives you a tight hug, that means she really likes you. So Sarah, and she drives home. I don't think she, chances are she has her license. Most people by like early 20s get their license, obviously. But she might bust to the St. Hubert's, obviously. If she busts, walks, walk her to her bus stop and stay with her until she's at her bus stop. So I'm saying, until the bus arrives. And give her a hug before she leaves. Hey, bye, I'll see you. I'll talk to you soon. See you later. Yeah, I'll see you later, Ivan. See you at work. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I'll text you and say, yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? You give her a nice hug. So I'm sorry. I don't know. I'm with her. I go, I don't know, 7.30 approaches. It's, 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 the, 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 the day of the date comes, I'm fucking nervous. My heart's pounding and beating. I hope this date goes well. Because I have no experience with women, obviously. I'm sweating, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm fucking nervous, you know what I'm saying? And I go, and it's like it's like seven o'clock. I don't. Know, I take my shower around six forty, and I leave around seven ten. Seven o five. I leave. Just leave early. Don't leave like at seven twenty. Otherwise, you're gonna show up late to the date. Don't do that. Leave around seven o five. Seven o five is good. It's like a twelve thirteen minute walk to St. Hubert's. I'll be there around seven seventeen seven eighteen. You're there on time. Just in case she's waiting for you and you show up on time. Oh my god, Ivan came on time for his date. Yes, the woman will like you. She'll appreciate you. So I'm saying, I don't know, I'm there. I don't know, I show, I go there. She's not there yet. And then she shows up there. She shows up there and she's like, Ivan. And she gives me a hug. I'm like, holy shit. Everyone's staring. <laughs> I don't know, while I'm waiting for her, everyone knows, oh my god, Ivan's at St. Hubert's, is that his first date? You guys saw my videos, Ivan's waiting at the front of St. Hubert's, he's having a smoke, yeah, I'm having a smoke because I'm stressed out, I'm nervous, obviously. Is that, is Ivan going on his first date? <laughs> with, with the woman, obviously, you know what I'm saying? Is Ivan going on his first date, obviously, and they, you guys, the whole, all of them will know. Ivan's waiting at the front of St. Hubert's, he, I think he's going on his first date. You know what I'm saying, and I, what? And uh, they're all curious. I wonder what she looks like. And she shows up, obviously. She shows up and what? She shows up and uh, and she's like, Ivan, she gives you a hug. You know, I'm like, holy shit, she looks hot. She dressed nice for me, man. Yeah, she, I don't know. She, gets, she drives there or she, she gets the bus. I see her walking. She looks very nice. She dressed nice for me. Holy shit, she dressed nice for me, man. 
Yo, it's sad that she gives me like a big hug. Everyone's staring, man. Everyone almost staring. <laughs> and so she's full on top of it. She'll be nervous too. I hope this date goes well. She doesn't want to fuck the date up, obviously. This is my chance of, of being in a relationship with Ivan. I don't want to fuck this up. Yeah, she's nervous, obviously. So, Sarah. And then we go inside, and you, I'll, I'll have the date. I'll, I'll talk with her for good, maybe. I don't know. Two hours, maybe? So we have a day at 7.30. At 9.30, we get out of the restaurant. So I keep talking there. You know, I'm like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, is that the bill? Yeah, that's the bill. I'm like, hey, do you want to you leave? Or do you want to leave? Or, oh, I, yeah, let's leave. Okay, fine, we'll leave. You know what I'm saying? And what? And before she leaves, obviously, I had a great time with you, by the way. I mean, yeah, I had a great time, too. I'll talk to you soon. I'll see you later. You know, I'll say, yeah, I'll see you later. I, I just want to say I had a great time. This is this is, this is is one of the best experiences of my life. You know what I'm saying? And she, yeah, mine, too, Ivan. She had a man. She gives you a hug. Bye. I'll see you later. She says, bye. You had a good date with her, obviously. And everyone's staring, obviously. Yeah, and if I try with her, then she's looking at something crazy. <laughs> Me and her will be floating on top of the world. It's like, holy shit, this is crazy, Ivan. Like, wherever, in the restaurant, like, while I'm in the restaurant, people are taking bills and pictures of us. Yeah, it's just, you're on top of the world. It's an amazing feeling. Awesome. There is a, a small chance I might train guys with her. And if, if I train with her, she'll be feeling on top of the world. And she'll like you even more. You know what I'm saying? If she tells her, her, her what? Her employees at work, they're going to ask her, hey, how was the date? Oh, my God, I had the best experience of my life. Yeah. I, I, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because I, I trained with her. That was the best day he's heard in my life. Oh, being with Ivan is such an amazing feeling, man. Because wherever I go, everyone takes pictures and reels of training with him. Yeah, I'm a son of God. Yeah, I'm special. Yeah. I'm Sarah. Ivan, will she be touchy touchy with you? Um, if she likes you, there's a high chance she might be touchy touchy with flirtatious around me. But look, man. If your flirtations are on me at work, the people are going to get suspicious. Unless I trend with her, then everyone will know I went out there with her. But if you're touching touch with me, the people can, even though they know, they can get envious. A bit envious. Because there's some people in this world who work their asses off just to get laid. And they get, they, they get have to pay for sex. Was I got you to go, to go on, a first, on a first date with me. And now you like me, obviously. And I like you. And I'm now going on a second date with you um, for, at the Elmer Bar. And what? She'll like you and she'll be even more flirtatious around you. I'm Sarah. Yeah. Obviously. But look, man, like when when I come to work and I see you, I can give you a hug, but like don't be too flirtatious around me. Otherwise, the employees can get a bit uh uh, uh envious. As as, as uh, I'm, I'm I'm the son of God, man. I'm a special. I'm Sarah. They can get a bit envious, the employees. I'm Sarah. <laughs> really, Ivan? Yes, they can get a bit envious. Hence why. What? Don't be too flirtatious around me. Chances are she will be flirtatious around me at work, obviously. She will be flirtatious around me at work. The uh, the chick, obviously. Chances are she'll be a bit flirtatious around me at work, obviously. The, uh, the, the, the chick, obviously. Hey, even though we trended and everyone knows we went on a date. So if you trend, you can't hide the fact that you're trending. Everyone will know you went on a date with her because you're trying with her, obviously. Some Sarah. But, like, it doesn't... Don't be too flirtatious at work. Otherwise, they can get a bit jealous and envious. Holy shit, if she had... She, you must, she must have had a blast going on that day with Ivan. Oh, my God. It was the best experience of my life, man. The best dating experience of my life. No date experience even comes close to this. When I'm with Ivan, everyone stares at me. Everyone's staring at Elmer. Everyone takes out their phone to take pictures. I'm feeling on top of the world, man. Yeah. I was in a way she's kind of piecing out with me pre King. So she, she's peace. She 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 she's saved in a way she's saved. Obviously, she's saved when I'm not King yet. When I'm when when when, when I'm an average person making average money, she feels a bit saved. But she's feeling on top of the world, and all those employees are gonna if I trend, they're all gonna feel like shit. <laughs> Holy shit! I even trending with her, man. What the fuck? I don't know. You, I don't know. I, I go out to dinner with her. I'm eating with her. I say, hey, people take out their phones and take videos, and like two. Two people they post two pit two two videos and pictures on Twitter 
and watch people retweeting the trends. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And the whole world now knows, yeah, Ivan's on a date with a girl. You know what I'm saying? And they all wonder what she looks like. Holy shit, she's beautiful. She's hot. Yeah, she's a redhead. And I'm saying, yeah, she's hot. He's like, I wonder what the girl looks like. I wonder what she looks like. And I'm saying, and Vijay sees her. Holy shit, she's beautiful. You know, say, what are you doing with my husband? I'm like, yeah, Vijay, you can't say shit. I shut you over good, man. You're a fucking crazy whore. Yeah. Obviously. But we should be a bit jealous. Of course she'll be a bit jealous. I'm a fucking husband, man. She'll be fine, obviously, but she'll be a bit jealous, obviously. A bit jealous. Obviously. Especially if the chick is attractive, she'll be jealous. Like, what the fuck? What are you doing talking to my husband, man? I'm like, yeah, VJ, what are, what are you doing dating Evan Berger? It's like, it goes both ways. You too. Yeah, there you go. Sincera. Yeah, if I trend with her, then everyone, the whole world will know. And I want to date with her, obviously. If I don't trend... I'm not telling the employees shit, but but it's you're still looking at something crazy. Everyone else will be staring at me and the chick. You're gonna see women giving her dirty stares because they they're, they're curious. Hey, Ivan's the son of God. You know what I'm saying? What does this chick have that I don't have? How beautiful is she? Is she more beautiful than me? How beautiful is she compared to Victoria Justice? You know what I'm saying? How beautiful is she? And they see her like, holy shit, she is. She's a beautiful woman. She is beautiful. Yeah, she's just she's a hot chick, obviously. Rob's like, holy shit, this chick is hot. You know, it's like, Rob likes redheads. <laughs> Rob Aaron likes redheads. I'm saying, holy shit, I was saying a redhead. Oh, like, yeah, he, he likes her. Like, holy shit, she's, she's hot. This Rob likes redheads, yeah. <laughs> he likes redheads, Rob. Yeah, man, what's that? Even though Rob is like 30 years old in there, but yeah. Rob likes redheads, yeah. I could talk for a little bit longer. I can make a three part video. Now I'm going to go work on the lawn. It'll get an hour and like 20 minutes. And I'll get a good like 11 bucks off it and I'll cash in my cans. And I'll get my smokes. If she gives me 15, I can cash in my cans and get beer, a one, one can of beer, and I can get uh, my 25. I gotta wait one. I gotta wait one week to get paid, man. I got paid next Thursday. My two for our check didn't come in yet. Yeah. Shot my camera, guys.